Okay, I've got a uh, 1995 Tomos Targa right here with an 835 engine and a uh, Homoet pipe and uh, pipe, it's power bands, kind of, kind of in uh, the higher RPM range. And I'm going to try doing a uh, little modification to my clutches to uh, get them to engage later. And uh, it's not so much... Uh, modification to the clutch at all. It's just I'm gonna try a different fluid setup and I'll show you what uh, I've got going on. So here I've got uh, some automatic transmission fluid, uh, Dexron, Mercon compatible stuff, uh, some gear oil, uh, 85 to 140 weight. I bought this little uh, uh, it's for mix and paint, but it's got milliliters on the side. Um, little syringe, 13 millimeter wrench, and another uh, another bowl to catch the old stuff in it. So basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to mix 350 milliliters of this, 350 milliliters of that. So it's going to be roughly twice what normally goes in uh, the Targus transmission. And I'm going to use this guy. You can get these at you know drugstores, um, Walmart, wherever. Um, I'm going to use this to fill it rather than a funnel. Just a little bit easier. You could still use a funnel. And that's a 13 millimeter wrench. So I'm going to grab this, this. Uh, so we've got a couple different bolts and things that we're working with. Up here we've got uh, the filler hole. This is the leveling hole. And here's the drain down here. So I'm going to use that 13 millimeter wrench, unscrew that guy, and drain it into here. Um, and then this, this leveling deal, we're not going to use that because uh, the 700 milliliters, uh, normally you'd fill it with this unscrewed and uh, it would just drip and level off, but we're going to overfill it. So we're going to leave that in, um, have everything measured beforehand, and then we're just going to fill it through here. So. so here we've got, this is what came out, that's what's going in. So you can see it's uh, quite a bit more. So I'm just going to keep filling up this syringe like this and then sticking it in here and down it goes and uh, just keep doing that till it's full. Well, I had a chance to test it out and uh, definitely works. Uh, Probably prior to this, I was probably shifting um, around, I don't know, just under 20, maybe 17 miles an hour or so it would shift from first to second. Uh, now it uh, it's more like 25 and uh, drops it right into the pipe's uh, power band. So uh, pretty, pretty significant difference. Uh,